Hello, my brothers and sisters, and to everybody else who's out there. Hope you're having a blessed day. And if you don't know the Lord Jesus Christ, I hope these videos bring you closer to Him and understand who He is and turn to Him before things uh, become too late, before it becomes too late. Well, what was on my heart today was the power of the blood of Jesus Christ. You know, when He shed that blood, He defeated everything. He defeated every enemy on the cross, the Bible says. The last enemy being death. The blood of Christ covers all sins. The blood that he shed, the amount of suffering that he endured on the cross, there is power in that blood. So when you talk to the Lord and you pray, thank him for shedding that blood. Because all that blood that he shed and only God knows how much of it it was because he was mangled he was dismembered he was torn apart but by his stripes we are healed by the blood we are covered God does not see sin anymore he sees the blood of his son the blood of his son covers all sins so when people talk about power and the blood people say well, what does that mean that's what it means people that don't know the power in the blood covers all sins. The power in the blood heals you. By his stripes we are healed. The chastisement of punishment was put upon him, and it pleased the Father to bruise him for our iniquities. But all that sin on his shoulders because of us. If that don't get any man, I don't know what will. That that blood is powerful. That blood defeated everything. So when you think about what he did on that cross for you and for me and for everybody else for the sins of the world, think about how much blood was actually shed. We don't know. We weren't there. The Bible doesn't tell you exactly how much blood was shed. But I can tell you that there was an exorbitant amount of blood loss. They had to be to cover everything. And again, everything was defeated on that cross. All the blood that was shed defeated all enemies. That's why he said, it's, it is finished. When he finally took his last breath, it is accomplished, it is finished. The devil is defeated. So when you think about him, and like I said, when you pray, think about how much he loves you. Even the ones who don't believe, He loves you more than you can imagine. Even the ones who hate Him, He loves you more than you can imagine. Because He, he shed His blood for you. The Bible says there's no greater love that have, that have that a man lays down his life for his friends. He is our friends. We are His children. The ones who are His sheep. If you have not come to Christ, I urge that you don't. And realize how much blood was shed for you, for me, and for the sins of the world. How much punishment was put on his shoulders because of us. Like I stated earlier, if you're not if you have not found Jesus Christ, I urge you do and I hope you don't. Time is running short one way or another. And God bless you all.